topic of this video will be the Dieckmann condensation. The Dieckmann condensation is just another name for an intramolecular Claisen reaction. For this condensation, we use a diester compound that can form a five- or six-membered ring, such as this one. When this diester is treated with base, we get a six-membered ring product. Now let's look at the mechanism. First, I'm going to redraw the diester in a way that makes it easier to see where the ring is forming. Next, let's number the carbons so that we can keep track of them throughout the mechanism. In the first step of the mechanism, the enolate is formed through depronation of the alpha position of one of the esters. This enolate ion is resonance stabilized. Next, the enolate attacks the other ester as an electrophile. forming the tetrahedral intermediate. In the final step, the carbonyl reforms, kicking off the leaving group to form the product. This product is a beta-keto ester, just like the product of other Claisen condensations.